Hello, this is the Watch Dog, and welcome back to Fun with Watches. If watches weren't fun, you'd only need one. Today we have an unboxing video for you. Just one watch. I was looking at AliExpress, and it looks like my next watch won't be for a while, so I figured I'd better unbox this one. Let's start with the wrist check. I'm wearing this Fossil LE 1100 GMT watch. This is the first watch I ever reviewed on Fun with Watches. I just changed the battery on it, so I wanted to wear it for the day. And Greg was wearing another old watch of mine, the Sterling Formula I, homage to the Newman Daytona. Grogo said he wrote a song about Bo Katan. It starts out Bo 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 Katan Bo 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 Katan. I said just like the Beach Boys, Barbara Ann. He said no, I was just stuttering because I have a frog in my throat, literally. All right, let's get this box open. This is going to be a good one. I know what it is because I looked. And that's why I didn't really want to wait for another watch. Because I knew this was going to be a good one. Looks like I have a wrapper inside a wrapper. I don't know why they bothered with that, but that's fine. But now, looking forward to this watch. And as you can see, it's a C-stern. This is the very first C-stern on my channel. And uh, I've, already, always, I've always been interested in C-stern, but they've always been a little bit out of my price range. But they had a pretty good deal on this one, so I figured I'd go for it. Man, it's really in here good. Alright, here's the watch. This is an unboxing video. So, here, we got the instructions. And wow, they give you a really big thing of instructions. It's huge. Then we have the unsigned warranty card. And then we have a little screwdriver. Yep, it's a screwdriver, not a sizing tool. So that means we have screw pins... And it looks like they gave us some extra spring bars. I don't know why. Because there's not a... Yeah, there's no extra strap or anything. So I don't know why they gave us extra spring bars. But I'll take it. So here's the watch. Let's get the wrapper off. This, of course, is an homage to a Doxa. I'm not that familiar with Doxas. They're uh, popular among certain enthusiasts, but not as well known as some watches. And I've, I've had the Pagani Design homage to the Doxa 300. And I'm pretty sure this is for the Doxa 600, which is a little bit nicer watch. But it looks like the plastic's coming off pretty good. But yeah, this is a really nice looking watch. And once again, this is my first Seastern. They had a pretty good sale on these the other day. So I went ahead and went for it. Me, of course, I have to buy my watches because nobody's given me watches yet. Well, I've had one I've had two watches given to me, and uh, Bernie's given me a few watches at a significant discount. But other than that, I've had to buy all my watches. So, but no, that's a very good looking watch. I like it. Let's check out the bezel action. Oh, the bezel action's good. Not too stiff, but not too loose. Not, not a lot of play in it. Uh, feels like 120 click. So yeah, then uh, once again, uh, it came with a screwdriver, so that means we have screw pins. So let's put it on the wrist and see what it looks like. Here's the watch on my seven and a half inch wrist, unsized. Did I say unsized? Bonk, bonk, bonk. Uh, it looks like I need to push it in one micro adjust and then it's going to fit. 
which is fine for me because that makes sizing it easier, but it kind of sucks if you have a wrist bigger than seven and a half. Uh, maybe seven and three quarters, will, you'll be able to do it, but anything bigger than seven and three quarters, you are not going to be able to wear this watch on the supply bracelet unless you get some extra links. Of course, I've been told that you can ask the AliExpress store you order it from for some extra links and they might comply. I've never had to do that, though, so I've never tried it. I'm just going by what other reviewers have said. But, yeah, uh, kind of surprising. I was uh, expecting a longer bracelet. Well, thank you for watching my unboxing video, and I will be back with another review. Be sure and like and subscribe to my channel. Bye. Oh, I just wanted to add one thing about the size. It looks like it is in one micro adjust position. So you can let it out one position. So that makes it a little bit longer, but not much. All right. Bye.